Hi YouTube friends, it's Lola from Lola's Life Lessons and today I wanted to talk about why I decided to quit the carnivore diet experiment and if you're interested in knowing why, keep on watching. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button and click that notification bell for future videos. Hello old friends and new friends and for those that don't know me, hi, I'm Lola. I've been doing the carnivore diet experiment now for 17 weeks and my goal was to do it for a year. I will post my three update videos down below. For those of you who don't know what the carnivore diet is, it is a diet where you eat meat and you drink water. So you would eat meat when you're hungry and you would drink water when you're thirsty. So this movement was started by Dr. Sean Baker and you can find him on Instagram. His Instagram is Sean Baker 1967, I believe. My protocol was eating meat once a day and I would eat as much meat as I wanted until I felt full and satisfied. My beverage was water no coffee or tea, no alcohol, and I would drink water throughout the day. It might sound strange that I decided to cut coffee out, um, coffee or tea, but I cannot seem to drink my coffee without cream or molasses in it. So that's why I eliminated coffee from this experiment. So basically what I did was a carnivore slash OMAD. So OMAD is where you eat one meal a day, my style of OMAD is that I did not count calories. So this leads to why did I quit the carnivore diet experiment? Why am I even telling you guys that I quit? It's really important to me for my channel, for myself, to be transparent with you guys and just to be honest. That's really, really important. So back to why did I quit? I could never seem to shake the cravings that I was having, the sugar cravings, cravings for carbs. Week 16, I gave into my cravings. I don't want to say what I had because I don't want to trigger anyone. When I was doing this carnivore diet experiment, I wasn't hungry. And actually, when I would eat meat, especially steak, I would always feel that I was full and satisfied. And I would feel this weight for a very, very long time. It was actually being around carbs and sweets and the smells and going to parties, birthday parties, get togethers, family get togethers, that really, really um, was difficult. It actually got to the point where I couldn't have carbs or sweets in my house. And I started to feel like it was very unfair to my other family members because they are not doing the carnivore diet and they're basically still eating um, a standard diet. And even though I would have my OMAD before I went to any sort of family get togethers or parties, and I would always make sure that I had adequate fat, um, I would always have a nice big ribeye before I went out, I always still felt tempted and I still experienced cravings when I would be at these family get togethers and parties. Anyways, as I said, I quit the carnivore diet experiment. I'm still eating meat five days a week. Monday to Friday. However, on the weekends, I am now allowing some carbs into my diet. This has been working well for me so far. However, I do still feel really guilty because I didn't see this through. I didn't see this to the 52 week mark, the one year mark, and I really wanted to accomplish that. Carnivore diet is amazing. And I realized that during this short experiment that eating just meat is optimal fuel for my body. My mind and body was at its best during that time. I realized that I can do one meal a day as lifestyle, but I also realized that I don't think I can do the carnivore diet as a lifestyle, eating just meat and no carbs at all. I'm a foodie at heart. I love food, I love the textures, I love preparing food, I love cooking food, I love tasting food. 
I love to taste everything that I cook. I'm not sure if I'm gonna continue with the before and after clips that I've been doing for you guys. My husband actually said that he thinks that I should continue to do the um, before and after clips up until the 52 weeks, even though I've completely changed protocol. But I'm not really sure at this point what I'm gonna do. So I wanted to show you guys the before and after for weeks one and week 17. Hi YouTube friends, it's actually week 17 of the carnivore diet experiment. And as of week 16, I decided that I was going to quit the experiment. And so what I've been doing is I've been eating meat um, during the week and I decided that now on the weekends, I'm going to be allowing carbs. So, So because I quit the experiment, I'm not sure if I should continue with these before and after. So let me know if you guys would like me to still continue with the before and after clips. All right, bye. So I just wanted to say thank you to each and every one of you. And I really appreciate your love and support. I love each and every one of you. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe, please like, please share. And I want all of you guys to stay happy and happy. Bye.